What are you doing? Um, I was just, uh, looking at the new shoes. So you're just gonna open my package without even asking? I just figured you'd do a first thoughts. And you're getting fingerprints all over the patent leather. I didn't put any fingerprints on them. Don't do it. I just touched it with my tongue. God, dear. What is up, Sneak Geeks? It is your boy, Sneaker Life. So I noticed, I think we gotta go back to the old ways. Um, I decided to ask on Twitter what you guys thought. First thoughts, should we do the first thoughts of the Jordan, or should I just get back to the Air Jordan 11 on foot review like I used to do? And you guys said both. So what I'm gonna do is that exactly. I'm gonna do both. I'm not gonna go too in depth with this shoe. Um, I've had so many different opinions about this shoe. Um, at first, I was like, man, you know what? I truly, I don't think I like it too much. I don't, the reason being because the 45 on the back, yes, it's nice, yes, it's something new, but why not just keep the Space Jam what it was? Keep it original, that's what I like. I don't like this whole all Monstars goofiness. I'm not gonna sit here in front like Space Jam isn't the greatest movie of all time. As you can see, they even put Bugs Bunny on the back of the box. Just overall, the whole box, the presentation is actually pretty amazing. Because if you really look at it, look at the details, you can see the gloves of the different cartoons, the Monstars, you know, it, it's, it's pretty incredible. But I think Nike is marketing it a little too much. I really wish they would have just kept the Space Jam what it was. But you know, this is a nice little addition to anyone that is, has never had a pair of Space Jams and you know, it's the closest thing you can get to that is wearable. Unless you decide to pick up a pair from 2011. But as far as these go, man, you know, it's basic. We got the blue soles that everyone used to call Fugazi. Um, even though not knowing that actually the original Space Jams that Jordan wore actually did have blue soles. We have the very nice patent leather, the nice cuts of the OG, and you know, overall, it is a great shoe. And I know you're gonna buy it, truthfully. This is what you want for Christmas, this is what you want your parents to get you, this is what you've been saving up for, and I think you'll be able to get it. If I had to say the best Jordan 11 release in the last few years, this would probably be it, you know? Um, this is going to be another huge general release, but still very limited at the same time because so many people are going to get a hold of it. It's going to be one of those shoes that everyone in your high school probably has, and it's a shoe that you probably want to store away for quite some time and then pull it out. And it's extremely easy to store, as you guys can see from last year's release. I still haven't even broke mine out yet. Um, I still randomly see people rock these until they're kind of just rare. I'm just gonna keep them in a plastic bag. Go ahead and get a plastic bag. Go ahead and pick up all the cash. You danced all night, you deserve it. So yeah, definitely in my opinion, um, first thoughts is this shoe is $220, the usual. Um, it's gonna be a hot seller. It's dope, it's very nice in hand. I have no complaints, there's no glue stains, no any major flaws, it just looks like a perfectly executed shoe. And there you guys have it, man. I'd love to hear what you have to say about it. Will you be copying? Probably. Um, stay tuned for the on foot review. I'll try to get that out by Friday, which is tomorrow. So look out for it. I'll do the on foot and we'll get this thing rolling, man. I'm really excited for these. December 10th is when they do drop. They're going to come out in all different sizes. Get your little kids, get your wife, get your dogs, whatever you want to do. These are going to be available. If you guys want to know where I got these, it'll be down below in the description. But there you guys have it. This is your boy, Sneaker Life. I'll see you in the next. Ooh, I'm Mike. Look at me. I say run it. I say run it. I say Junior. Run it. I'm trying to end the video, man. Why Why do you always have to ruin everything? Hands in the air now. Hands in the air now. Shut up. Yeah, that's why I licked your shoes. I'm the MVP. I'm stupid with this rap shit.